Trob with two guys in a ride. We're taking a walk on the outside of SEMA. <clears throat> Man, lots going on inside and outside. You can see just hordes of people. Got some uh, vendors over here as well. I see Mothers, I see Mecham Auction, King Off-Road Racing Shocks, so many more. You can see all these beautiful vehicles. There are loads and loads. It's eye candy everywhere you look. It's amazing. Yeah, people everywhere you look. McGuire's booth, more activities. Get a zoo, walk over here, get you some views of these beautiful vehicles. Look at this baby. Boy, that's high up there, isn't it? Let's take a look inside there. Look at that suspension. Wow, there's some detail, that's some action going on there, folks. A lot of thought process behind that. Beautiful Rubicon here. Yeah, lots of great stuff. Look at these trucks, look at these wheels, look at the suspension. There's been <laughs> no, no single penny spared on these. Every single thing has been done and spent. Beautiful vehicles, love this old Toyota Land Cruiser. Hard to beat that, look at that. Absolutely gorgeous, beautiful vehicle. Oh man, I could drive that one home. That would be fun. <laughs> lots of folks, lots of beautiful vehicles. Lots of manufacturers. This is SEMA 2022. Everything and anything you could think of for a vehicle, you can find it here. If it's not here, I honestly doubt it exists. It's here. If it isn't here, it just doesn't, doesn't exist. This is the Las Vegas Convention Center and this whole giant complex inside and outside is full of folks, beautiful vehicles, vendors, builds. Oh man, builds, talk about builds. Look at this Galaxy 500, look at this thing. It is absolutely beautiful. Oh, look at that. No expense spared, folks. These are beautiful vehicles, I'll tell you. Absolutely gorgeous. Trying to give you a little bit of flavor of what's out here. So if you ever get the opportunity to come to this, you can certainly, I advise you, definitely do it. You can pick up your SEMA swag as well from the SEMA, gag, the SEMA gear trailer. More lifted vehicles, beautiful GTO over here as well. Yeah, I agree, commenter. Everything here, absolutely beautiful. Hard to really say exactly what, uh, I would be hard pressed to pick out a favorite, although I do love this Bronco here. Mud digger, off road, look at that. Look at the camo, but then look at this beauty underneath. It's absolutely gorgeous. Got some sweet Fox shocks. Look at that suspension, look at those rails. Yeah, she's a bunking, bucking Bronco for sure. Absolutely beautiful. There's a Motor Trend booth. Gonna have some celebs over there to talk to. Get to meet them. Got to meet several a couple years ago when I was here, that was really fun. Yeah. Look at this McLaren. Love the sweet little Forerunner. That's pretty darn cool too. Look at that. Yeah. And this McLaren. Gorgeous. Yeah. All right. Let's take a walk in here and see what we got. You see, we're in Vegas. That's the Encore and the Wynn Hotel, and you got the Conrad. But here we go. This is Mother's, their booth. You can see some of the vehicles there. Nice old original Hummer. Beautiful Nomad here. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous. Street rod. Then you got a Lotus over here. Look at that beautiful Lotus. Yeah. There you go. Deuce Coupe. Beautiful. Bin pack, you got Coker tire. Ah, uh, look at this Mopar over here. Yeah, sweet. Saw these guys at uh, Good Guys in Des Moines, Iowa this summer. They always have some beautiful vehicles, some beautiful rides showcasing their awesome tire. Tire packages that they have. 
It's absolutely a beautiful car, that old Chrysler. Look at that. And there's some of the red lines that they've got. Firestone radio, wide oval. And it's the Coker guys. Yeah, there you go. All right. Here we go. Let's stack them up. You want to buy a few more extra cars? There you go. You can stack them right up. I think I'm going to get one of those for my garage. I might have to raise the roof a little bit, but, uh, you know, why not? Definitely worth it. That's Ben Pack. We got Speedmaster. I mean, folks, whether or not you've got a vehicle or you're thinking about building a vehicle, this is definitely a show to come to, not only to source your parts to get the ideas of uh, what you can do with it, but, um, you know, to see how people have actually used these parts. And here we go. Hey, Dave Kendig and his group are here. Got some beautiful vehicles. Hey, look at this. I'm sure you've seen this. If you watch Kendig's show, you've seen these cars. Yeah, that's one of his specials there. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah, Dave does a really good job. He's got some amazing vehicles in here. You can buy a t-shirt, you can see the vehicles, and occasionally, uh, I think uh, a couple times a day, they actually do have a, an autograph signing, so you get to meet Kev Dog and Dave. I actually had a chance to meet them a few years ago at the um, uh, Back to the 50s weekend in Minnesota. That was kind of cool. And you see again, here's one of those beautiful conversion vehicles that one-offs that Dave builds. Absolutely spectacular vehicle, folks. Look at that. It's gorgeous. If you ever watch uh, Ken Diggett's Bitchin', Bitchin' Rides on Motor Trend, you've seen this vehicle. Wow. How spectacular is that? Absolutely gorgeous. Color Bear, everything. You got folks sitting here waiting for some Big Daddy's barbecue. You got Exo Noble paint. Look at this beautiful Ford. Gorgeous. Lots of talent. I can't believe the variety of talent that is on display here so much. I mean, look at this. Look at this cool Bronco over here. <laughs> that is absolutely awesome. I love the paint scheme on it. Love that. It's just dripping. Yeah, that's just talent, folks. That's amazing. It's so awesome. Here we got Wizards. Wizards Wax and Professional Detailing and Finishing Products. Yeah. Oh, look at the Riviera. Absolutely gorgeous. Love this. This is the early rib with the exposed headlights. Beautiful, beautiful car. Actually, I thought it was black, but if I get closer to it, it's blue. Man, blue with the red interior, the red lines on it, the Willwood brakes. Wow, that's gorgeous. Actually, it looks like one that I saw on the Ken Diggs most recent show that was an award winner out in, um, I forget, they had a car show in Ohio, I think. So. Really cool. All right, they also do have a ride along and this is sponsored by eBay Motors. And I think you can actually ride along in one of the Supras. Doesn't look like they've got it going right now. We'll get some video footage of that a little bit later, but you can see there's folks lined up ready for it. Take a ride, lose their lunch. Not quite sure I want to do that. <laughs> I'm okay sitting outside the vehicle, outside here and filming it for you. There's Fox Shocks. Alpha must be speakers, Alpha Sonic. Beautiful Porsche. Yeah. Ride Fox. So here we go. Fox Factory. I'll try not to talk over the heavy bass that's playing right now. It's probably going to kill my monetization on this video with that playing in the background. But, you know, that's cool. I want to bring you guys sight and sounds of SEMA and this is it and you see Yamaha you got some jet skis here a little bit of everything Vance and Heinz I'm not sure what that is but uh, there's some beautiful bikes here look at these look at that beautiful Harley oh, old Honda in the back love that Honda monkey <laughs> Really, really cool. All right, we're gonna to continue to walk around. I see Tremec, which of course is uh, transmissions. I see eBay Motors. Oh, look at this. I've seen a lot of these mid-70s Impalas, these donks here this weekend. 
Absolutely love this body style, love these Impalas. This is Hoonigan. Look at that. That's a sweet ride there. <laughs> That's got some horsepower under, well, no hood, but it's there. It got some horsepower, definitely. Look at that. They've done a nice job on that car. That is fantastic. <laughs> you just got to look and you got to appreciate the talent that goes into building something like that. Here's eBay Motors, a quick scan of them. There is a grandstand for folks to sit up to see the ride along a little bit later. But we're going to take a walk over here past Tremec and see what's on this other row here. Okay, we'll do a quick pass by of Tremec because you know, these are terrific transmissions. They really know what they're doing here. Yeah. These guys are awesome. Here we go. Show you a little bit of their product line here. Oh yeah. yeah. Here you go. And hey, look at this. Love this Jeep. We're going to cover the overlanding area in a little bit too, because, um, you know, overlanding is still huge. It's big. You got a whole area dedicated to overlanding here at SEMA. And I'm going to cover that in videos and hopefully do some live, live streaming there as well. And we see mothers polishes again. And look at this. Talk about overlanding. Here we go. Here's the whole setup. Nice Jeep. You got the Mission trailer, Mission Overland. Even got the van. Look at that. The pop-up camper, solar panels, all outfitted side by side. And then our friends here at Mecham Auto Auctions, you know, we had the great pleasure of going down to Kissimmee in January. We're going to be headed back to Kissimmee in January this year and see all the folks here. See Scott Hoke over here. And of course, we had a nice interview with John Craman. But yeah, our friends here at Mecham Auto Auctions. So yeah, we're excited to get back down to Kissimmee this year and, and provide you more coverage there as well. So that's it for right now, folks. Thanks for watching. This is a SEMA walk around and we will be doing more live streaming very soon. Thanks for watching.